السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته uh, Dear respected colleagues I'm Dr. Hiba Usama uh, uh, Associate Professor of Human Anatomy and Embryology Faculty of Medicine in Zagazit University and also in Primo Patch 2022 The project title uh, uh, is Implementation of Case-Based Learning as a Method of Anatomy Teaching in Faculty of Dentistry and Oral Medicine Egyptian Russian University uh, the advisor of the project is Dr. Marwa Ibeir. The began chart of uh, uh, our project was planned to start it uh, by presenting the plan uh, of the project uh, at my school in the beginning of uh, January 2022, and uh, then later on uh, go on uh, developing the material for training uh, the uh, faculty. Uh, this in parallel with the uh, uh, getting the approval of IRP. Uh, then after this, we uh, started rapidly to uh, train the team and uh, to start to formulate the cases which needed to be introduced through our uh, curriculum and uh, starting to uh, select uh, some topics and timing of introducing the cases. Uh, according to the ILOs, which can be served by presenting the cases through them. Uh, then rapidly, in the, uh, it was planned also to start the implementation with the beginning of March, because the shortage of the, uh, uh, the semester, uh, and the implementation began by introducing cases in sessions that is scheduled previously uh, to have the uh, objectives needed to these cases. Uh, the last phase of uh, our uh, dent chart, data collection and the analysis, which uh, was running parallel to the uh, uh, implementation in each session, as it began usually by presenting the pre-test, then followed by post-test for the student to assess their knowledge. And lastly, the end stage of uh, uh, collecting the data is um, uh, conducting a questionnaire uh, for both students and faculties to assess the, uh, uh, their satisfaction about the case presentation or case introducing through uh, the curriculum. Lastly, the analysis of the results and reporting and forming the poster presentation by the end of September, inshallah, will be conducted. There is minimal change uh, applied to the Gantt chart. This change uh, applied in the time schedule because there, is, uh, there was a delay in the IRP approval as we uh, ch uh, chose uh, the uh, newly formed or new newly established faculty like in Russian University, they, don't they didn't have previously an uh, ethical committee. Because of this, they found the ethical committee to, uh, and my IRP approval was the first, <laughs> with the first approval. <laughs> and the, the first research in the uh, institute. This delay in the IRP approval uh, lead to some uh, sort of delay in the implementation, in the stage of implementation and the training, and uh, uh, leads to limited cases introdu introduction in the curriculum. So the changes applied, as we mentioned, is the in application calendar due to the delay of IRP approval and lead to conducting limited cases due to narrow available time. The lesson learned, your belief in your project can develop a great change. As we said, we found the IRP uh, committee or ethical committee in the institute. Minimal changes lead to major change at the end. To your team, uh, they are the main support of your project. Uh, and this is uh, the final uh, of my presentation. Thank you.